ಶ್ರೀ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶ್ರೀವಾಸಾದಿ ಗೌರ ಭಕ್ತ ವೃಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ Okay, so Vinita Mataji, are we chanting one round in the beginning of the class? Mataji, one round is taking a lot of time today. I saw in Govinda, maybe 21 times, whatever you used to do before, right? Okay. So let's do 21 times the chanting of the Maha Mantra. Who wants to uh, volunteer for that? So one person would do and everyone else will also do on mute. but we will hear only one person smriti wonderful smriti yeah go ahead smriti and you can chant 21 times uh, with devotion and attention and uh, with a prayer that please engage me in this in your service yes mataji can you hear me mataji yes yes smriti we can hear you and everyone also please chant Uh, if you can turn on your videos at least for chanting it will be great i can see you all chanting um then we can uh, everyone i can we can see you chanting but we will hear smriti chanting when we'll chant along that smriti you can start now hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare hare thank you mataji wonderful smriti thank you so much so chanting is a very very important devotional service that we need to practice since we are very young okay so we will try and do one round it wouldn't take more than 10 minutes but we will practice first this we have been doing 21 times maybe we will do 51 and then we can go to one round slowly okay so today we have are seeing the 16th chapter um so let me share the screen for the 16th chapter and at least you can all recite the verses uh, seeing uh, the screen and uh, in the verses that we have done that is 16.1 16.2 16.3 16.4 and 16.21 Divyansh, welcome Divyansh. We were missing you so long. Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Which grade are you in now? Eight. Eight. Wow. Your voice seems to have changed a little bit. You're growing into a young man now, right? Yeah. 
Nice to hear you, Divyansh. Okay, so we are in the 16th chapter. Let me share the screen. Okay, 16.1, who would like to decide? Yes, Virinda, I was hoping whether you're there or not. Wonderful, Vrinda. Thank you so much. Tulasi Manjari, can you do the second verse? Yes, Matiti. Ahimsa satya makro das tyaga shantira paishunam daya puteshva aloluptvam mardavam hira chapalam. Very good. Third verse. Mukund, would you like to chant? Yes, Mataji. Ejokshamadrite saucham adroho nati manita bhavanti sampadam devim abhijatasya bharata. Thank you, Mataji. Very good, Mukund. And who would like to read the translation? <coughs> Smriti, would you like to read the translation? Yes, Mataji. The Supreme Personality of God had said, fearlessness, purification of one's existence, cultivation of spiritual knowledge, charity, self-control, performance of sacrifice, study of the Vedas, austerity, simplicity, non-violence, truthfulness, freedom from anger, renunciation, tranquility, aversion to fault-finding, compassion for all living entities, Freedom from covetousness, gentleness, modesty, steady determination, vigor, forgiveness, fortitude, cleanliness, and freedom from envy and passion for honor. These transcendental qualities, O son of Bharata, belong to the godly men endowed with divine nature. Beautiful Smriti. Thank you. So I'm going to ask you questions from this translation. Can you tell me the free, three freedoms? Uh, that one has to achieve for divine nature. Freedom from anger, freedom from envy, and freedom from covetousness. Wonderful. So freedom from anger, freedom from covetousness. What do you mean by covetousness? You can Google and tell me. Marked by inordinate desire for wealth or positions for another position. Yes. You want Ex somebody else things. Exactly. Covetousness is, you may not really want it, but if somebody else has it, you want it no matter what. So that is having a craving for possession, covetous of power like that. So we should get freedom from that, freedom from anger, freedom from envy and the passion of, for honor. These are transcendental qualities. Okay, what should one have aversion to? Fault finding. Mm. Can you explain that a little bit, Smriti? Like one person um, um, should not say, um, if he, um, 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 even um, like there's some kind of people, there's, uh, there's um, I remember once there's three kinds of people. The first kind of person he finds good and bad. Second finds good even and bad. And um, third person finds um, um, bad in good. Even though somebody has so many good qualities, 
he was always in a uh, oh he does chanting he does 64 rounds every day and on ekadashi he does a uh, one on the round but all you would find is oh he eats too much he am a chanti samosas if you let him that's all is what you am um, think and then if um, i want to go to oh he she every um, she wake up at 2:30 every day and um, do um, deity worship but then um, um you will think oh she um, she is a terrible cook whatever she will eat is taste like tires <laughs> wonderful how old uh, um, how old are you smriti 10 mata ji 10 where are you living charlotte oh charlotte okay nice are you are you charu mata ji's daughter yes mata ji okay i heard about you and your mom wonderful that's very nice so even though a person may do very wonderful thing we tend to find the fault right what is the fault so that we should have aversion to that means if you are finding fault we should say what is this how bad it is aversion means something that you don't like with great distaste is there something that you don't like to eat mukund uh, yes mata ji uh I don't like to eat um let me ask the name of it from my mom <laughs> okay yeah uh, i hate sattu ke parathe okay so even if you're hungry and if i give you that to eat what would you do mukund If I'm super hungry, I would eat it. Otherwise, I would not. Right. So you have an aversion for that, right? Yeah. That shows that we are all individual people. Somebody likes something. Somebody doesn't like something. That means that we are individual persons and personalities, and that is good. That's a proof that you can't explain why you don't like it. Can you explain? You can't explain, right? Why you like something and why you don't like something. so that is true so so when we have imagine we we should have an aversion to fault finding like that if somebody is finding fault then we should have a aversion to that no i'm not going to do that that's like how we hate to eat, eat things that we don't like great okay so we'll go to the next verse who can read this verse i can see can i read it uh yes uh, let me give chance uh, did you read it smriti before no you read only the translation yes mother okay yeah go ahead and read this verse and divyansh maybe you can read the translation <laughs> very good Divyansh, can you read the translation? Pride, arrogance, conceit, anger, harshness, and ignorance. These qualities belong to the those of demoniac nature, O son of Krita. Thank you, Divyansh. So you see, these if we have any of these, then we have the demoniac nature. So we need to see. Uh, and krishna is saying that these are the qualities born or belong to those of demoniac nature okay and then we did text 21 is a very beautiful chapter but he explains that how what is a what is meant by demoniac thinking how people will think when they are demoniac what is the result of that how they look into the world and all those things then we have text 21 last week we did um, anybody who has not read the shloka so far would you like to read text 21 tulasi manjari okay you yes mataji yes uh, okay if no one else is there you can read the shloka uh trevad 
Trividham Narakasya Dham Dvaram Nashanam Atmanah Kama Krodas Tatha Dvobhas Tasmad Etat Trayam Tyajet Wonderful. Okay, can someone read the... Mataji, you went on mute. Can someone read the translation? Tulsi Manjali, go ahead. Me? Yes, Tulsi Manjali, go ahead. These are the three gates leading to this hell. Lust, anger, and greed. Every sane man should give these up, for they lead to the degradation of the soul. Hmm, yeah. Yeah. Smriti, Smriti, do you remember what Mataji taught last time, three gates, right? Yes, Mataji. Yeah, can you explain something? Yeah, Mataji is back. Uh, Mataji can go. Thank you, Mataji. So sorry, I had to run to open the front door. Somebody was there and no one is there in the house. So, yeah. Okay, thank you, Mataji. Thank you, Smriti. Would you like to explain something that you heard? Yes, Mataji. So when when they said three gates leading to hell, they gave an uh, they gave a picture of three elevators, and each and they said even if you follow one of these, um, it's uh, you automatically go to hell. Like when you go to there's a big shopping mall, and maybe the one pair of stairs may be crowded, so they all give three and uh, they'll give many stairs. But at the uh, but the ultimate destination is just the uh, top floor. So like that, uh, even if you can do even one of these, you will still go to the same place. And and there's a degradation of the soul. Um, um, and they um, and they were talking about like in each hell they do something different to your soul. Like they'll beat it, they'll fry it, they'll do all these things to your soul and it'll be really hurt. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Smriti. So that's the reason that we should avoid that To We should avoid having demoniac qualities. Now, we'll see the last chapter of 16th for today. Okay, repeat after me. Tasma Chastram Pramanam Te Tasma Chastram Praman Tasma Chastram Pramanam Te Tasma Chastram Praman Karya Karya Vyavastitao Karya 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 Vyavastitao Karya Karya Vyavastitao Karya Karya Vyavastitao Nyatva Shastra Vidhanuktam Nyatva Shastra Vidhanuktam Nyatva Shastra Vidhanuktam Yatva Shastra Vidhanakani Karma Kartum Ihar Hasi Karma Kartum Ihar Hasi Karma Kartum Ihar Hasi Karma Ihar Hasi Tasma Pramanam Te Tasmatrasramanante Karya Karya Vyavastito Karya Karya Vyavastito Nyatva Shastra Vidanuktam Nyatva Shastra Vidanuktam Karma Kartum Mihar Hasi Karma Kartum Mihar Hasi Okay, so now let's do the synonyms game. Arhasi, what does that mean? You should. Good job, Smriti. The regulations. Tell the Sanskrit. 
Vithana. Good job, Tulasi Manjari. The scriptures. Sastra. Good job, Vinita. Duty. Ka um, karma. Karya. Yeah. Good job, Tulasi. Um, knowing. Nyatva. Good job, Smriti. You are. Yeah. Good job, Tulasi yeah. Manjari. In this world. Jiha. Dark and forbidden activities. Akarya. Akarya. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Divyanj in determining. Vyavastito. Uh, Vyavastito. Good job. Divyanj. Evidence. Pramana. Good job. Therefore, does not do Kartum. Very good. As declared, Yuktam. Yuktam. Okay, good job. So I'm going to tell one line, and you need to, like, you know, make a meaningful uh, combination of the uh, word by word meaning, okay? Tasma chastram pramanam te. Therefore, this, um, the, the scriptures are some evidence. Okay, good. Karya, karya, vyavastitao. And they determine your the duty and your forbidden things. You should do and what you shouldn't do. Very good. Nyatva Shastra Vidanoktam. And no descriptions in the regulations. Yes, knowing the regulations of the scriptures as declared, knowing the regulations as declared in the scriptures. Karma Kartum Iharhasi. You should do work in this world. Good job, Divya. You should do work in this world. Okay, so um, who can read the translation? Divyanj, can you read the translation? Okay, Mataji. One should therefore understand what is duty and what is not duty by the regulations of the scriptures. Knowing such rules and regulations, one should act so that he may gradually be elevated. Good job, Divyan. So, how do we know, how do we understand what is duty and what is not duty? Uh, scriptures. Uh, by what the scriptures say, by the regulations of the scriptures. And why should we know the such regulations? So that we will be elevated. Mm, very good. So what if we act without knowing the regulations? Then we will... Then we might be, we will go to hell. Yes, we will not be elevated, right? Because we don't know what is not to be done. So scriptures are something that says us what is to be done and what is not to be done. Okay. Um, who can read this? Vinita, Vinita, can you read? Sure, Mataji. If one understands Krishna from the Bhagavad Gita and becomes situated in Krishna consciousness, engaged himself in devotional service, he has reached the highest perfection of knowledge offered by the Vedic literature. Yeah, the next one too, please. Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu made his process very easy. He asked people Simply to chant Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, and to engage in the devotional service of the Lord and eat the rem remains of food stuff offered to the deities. Very good. Thank you, Vinita. So, uh, who 
who has reached the highest perfection of knowledge offered by the Vedic literature? Means Vedas, there are Puranas, there are Itihasas, there are Vedanta Sutras, uh, there are Upanishads. So, but do we have access to all of them? But how do we attain um, perfection, highest perfection? By reading the scriptures and following the advice of uh, Guru Maharaj. Yes. So what is mentioned here in Bhagavad Gita is that we become situated in Krishna consciousness. And if we are engaged in devotional service, we don't need to exactly know all the rules and regulations that is told in the Vedas. If we do this much, then we are protected. Right? We don't know much. Do you have you read Vedas? Any of you? No, but we do. I have also not read Vedas, so I don't know how uh, what is told in that and what is not told. But then, who has made this process very easy? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Okay, what are the three things that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said we should do? Chant Hari Mahaprabhu, engage in devotional service, and eat only food that's offered to the deities and offer to Krishna. Very good, Smriti. So these are the three things if we do, then we are saved from the three gates to hell. Right? Because Chaitanya Mahaprabhu has given that process very, very simple and easy to do. Okay. So... Who, can you give, give me an example of some devotee who followed this and then uh, they attained the Lord? Prahlad, very good. Prahlad Maharaj and Sukadeva Goswami. Very good, right? Um, so all these people, they have followed this process. Okay, can you give examples of someone who has uh, followed this process, uh, who was a very sinful, but by the mercy of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu started following this process, and then they also attained perfection? Chicken. Yes, what is that? Madai. Very good. Jagai Madai, right? So Jagai Madai is a example of how even they were very uh, uh, very uh, degraded. Still, they can, they did not, they were able to uh, get themselves, they didn't go to hell. Why? Because they started chanting the Hare Krishna Mahamantra serving the devotees, eating only Krishna Prasadam. So they were saved. So these are the examples we have. Okay. So yeah, uh, someone else who has not read so far. Can you read this Mukund? Are you free? Mataji, can I read this? Um, can I can read. Okay. Yeah, Mukund, go ahead and next slide, uh, Divyansh can read. For the ordinary persons who are not in Krishna consciousness, what is it to be done and what is not to be done must be decided by the injunction, injunctions of the Vedas. That is called following the principles of Shastra or scripture. Shastra is without the four principles, principal defects that are visible in the conditioned soul. Imperfect senses, the propensity for cheating, certain certainty of committing mistakes, and certainty of being illusion. Thank you, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Thank you, Mukund. Yeah, what is meant by Shastra? Without the four principal defects. Yes, so Shastra is the... Uh, uh, is a thing that is are the scriptures or that which is without four principal defects. 
So let us look into what are the four principal defects. What is the first one mentioned here? Imperfect, imperfect sensors. Can anyone explain what is imperfect sensors? Yeah. Means our sensors are not poor. Yes, uh, Balavrinda, our senses are not perfect, right? We want to see, see, so many we, we have, sometimes we see, we see the sun and then we, but we are, we are seeing the sun so far away and then we can calculate if, if we make a, a by, by your hand, if we make like this, then we'll know, oh, the sun is only this much. Right, according to our eyes and according to the distance we see, we measure the sun's thing is within our hand, but sun is not like that, right? So we know because we know sun is so many distance away and so much, uh, 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 so hot. Actually, nobody can go near the sun, first of all, to make an experiment how big the sun, right? So with our senses, always we are not able to take the right in information because they are not perfect for example um, you might see something and uh, uh, you might forget something right have you all experienced that yeah eyes ears nose sometimes we hear something the teacher told this and then the teacher said that the assignment due date is the say first september but then we might be there, but still we might have heard 1st September, but we might understand it as 2nd September. So sometimes if we don't see, then we don't realize, oh, I made a mistake. Oh, I thought it was like this. So because of the imperfect senses. And the second thing is propensity for cheating. So what, what does this mean is everybody is, um, uh, we want to, although, Sometimes uh, we are not, we want to show that which we are not completely. For example, I know I'm not a perfect devotee, but sometimes I want to show off that, oh, I'm, a, I'm okay. I don't tell like that directly, but I think like that. And I want others to think that I'm a great devotee or I'm a great, um, uh, you know, artist or I'm a great cook or something like that. So propensity of cheating is, we have the propensity to exaggerate more than what we are, right? That is there in all the conditioned souls. And then certainty of committing mistakes. Is there anyone here among the eight of us here that can you tell me that you have never committed any mistakes so far? No one, right? So day in and day out, we have committed mistakes. Something that we know we should not do. So like that. So that is certainty. There we are certain. Surely we would commit mistakes. And then certainty of being illusioned. Illusion means uh, thinking things that are not there to be true. For example, there may be a shadow. Uh, somebody may be walking and then there may be a shadow. And then so if we look only at the shadow, then we think, oh my God, the shadow is moving. Maybe it's a ghost. Wow. And then we are scared, right? So sometimes we we are, so many times, I mean, mostly um, that we mistake. We mistake the truth to be false and the false to be true. That is called illusion. Okay. Tulsi Manjari, you want to say something? Okay, so these four defects are not there in the Shastras. And that is why whatever the Shastras say, we are supposed to take it. Because anything that is produced by man is going to have these defects. But the Shastras like Bhagavad Gita, this is that comes from the Lord and who is freed from these defects. So that is why we have to follow the scriptures. Okay. Let's go to the next slide. Uh, Divyan, she wanted to read it. Are you free? Yes, I can read it, Mahatishi. Yes, please go ahead. 
Without following the principles of the scriptures, one cannot elevate himself to the perfectional stage. One who actually therefore understands the purpose of the sastras is considered fortunate. In human society, aversion to the principles of understanding the supreme personality of Godhead is the cause of all fall downs. That is the greatest defense of human life. Thank you, Divan. So my question is, uh, is there an option? I mean, is studying the scriptures or Bhagavad Gita mandatory or is it optional? I mean, it is optional, but like it's better for you if you do it. Very good. So what happens if you do it and what happens if you don't read it? Okay. If you like... Yeah, Divyansh? If you like... um. If you like read the scriptures, that if you like read the scriptures, then you'll get to more about Krishna, and then you will be also be like more devoted to Krishna, and you can elevate yourself to the um, um, you can like elevate yourself to like the spiritual stages. Wow. But if you like don't read the scriptures, then you won't get to know much about Krishna consciousness, mm -hmm. and um. Well, you basically you won't be nearly as attached to Krishna, and that's what well, like you will be stuck in the material world or worse. Very good, Divyansh. I like it because when we when we don't understand this, when we don't read Bhagavad Gita, although it's optional, but the consequences of not reading is very scary. Why? Because we will not know what to be done and what is not to be done. And we will do things that is not to be done. And we will gl we will glide down into very uh, suffering and abominable existence. That's why it is said that if we have the aversion to the principles of understanding the Supreme Personality of Godhead is a cause of all fall downs. And when we give Bhagavad Gita to people, they say, no, I have it. My grandmother has it. My great grandmother has it. Because they're happy that Bhagavad Gita is for grandmother. But iPhone is for me, right? So no, but Bhagavad Gita is for everyone and we need to read it. And if we don't read it, it was mentioned here that that is the greatest offense of human life. So in one sense, although it is optional, seeing the consequences of not reading it and where we end up with. So in a human life, it's mandatory to read it so that we can apply the principles okay uh who wants to read the next one someone wanted to read smriti therefore maya the material energy of a supreme personality of godhead is always giving us trouble in the shape of threefold misery the material energy is constituted of three modes of material nature. One has to raise himself at least to the mode of goodness before the path to understanding the supreme God can be opened. Thank you, Smriti. So what are the threefold miseries? Age and disease. Where is that old age and disease? Uh, that are the four um, miseries. But it is threefold misery means based on and Adi Daivik. Very good, Balabrinda. So depending on the source of the miseries, they are they are classified into three types. One is adhyatmic, miseries from our own mind and body. Sometimes the mind would say, oh my God, nobody likes me. My friend hates me. And then the school, everyone are making fun of me. And I am like this and they are like that. Or, you know, it may not even be true, but the mind will, will make you, so many thoughts like this will come and then it will make you feel depressed. So my uh, miseries from the mind. And then misery is from one's own body. Suddenly you're walking and then you trip and fall down or something is not functioning properly in the body. You have um, a headache, stomach ache, fever, right? So one source is from our own body and mind. 
and the second one is from other living entities near us sometimes um, there are bugs that may bite us or sometimes uh, we may end up uh, arguing with some a uh, close friend and then we feel very bad about it or sometimes um uh, someone may say something harsh to us and uh, we are hurt so like this way there are messages coming from other living entities sometimes our near and dear ones they are undergoing troubles at that time also we we suffer right and who can tell me the source of the third type of messages adi daivika adi daivika means tornadoes tornadoes ah right tornadoes and now there is a heat wave and then there is snow storm and so many things sometimes tsunami sometimes earthquake so all these things we don't have control over so this is one of the source of mysteries so why why is all this who is giving us all this Yoga Maya. Who is giving us all this? Maya. Why? Is Maya so bad and sadistic that she wants to see us always suffer? No, she probably wants to check if we are true devotees or those weak devotees who like. they are only doing it for the sake of somebody else wonderful so this is we are seeing that whether i mean ma because we want to enjoy this material world so much maya is keep on reminding us mm -mm, oops this is not a place where you can enjoy always there's i am here constantly giving you trouble so that you may understand that there is nothing like going back to godhead or spiritual world okay so what are the three modes of nature that constitute the material nature goodness passion and ignorance very good goodness passion and ignorance so when we are in passion and ignorance can we trans uh, can we rise go to krishna no so at least we should rise up to which mode before going to krishna goodness goodness yes so being in goodness is very important then we can transcend the modes okay so here more about passion and ignorance who wants to read it those who have not read it so far mukund read tul asmriti read divyansh read तुलसी मंजरी विनीता मत जी आर यू आस्किंग टू रीड या रीड दिस या बाल वृंद यू कैन रीड मत जी द फर्स्ट लाइन नो द ऑल द थ्री पॉइंट्स ऑल द थ्री पॉइंट्स ओके वृंद जी दोस इन द मोड ऑफ पैशन एंड इग्नोरेंस दे राइट द स्क्रिप्चर्स derive the holy man and derive the proper understanding of the supreme personality of god the the sobi the sobi 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 the instructions of spiritual master and they do not care for the religious regulations of the scriptures if however one is able to guided by a proper and bona fide bona fide bona fide spiritual master who can lead one to the path of elevation to the higher stage then one life becomes successful thank you brindavan so uh what are the what do the men in the mode of passion and ignorance do the men in passion and ignorance they uh, uh, they in ignorance they completely ignore that there's something called scriptures and and they say scriptures oh what is that is this new is it a new type of um, soft drink and then <laughs> more in passion and, and they think oh it's there but it's 
not mandatory. It's like those religions, like Christianity is there, but I don't have to do it. I don't have, um, it's not mandatory. So. Yeah, you're explaining so nicely. That's why I asked you to on your video. I want to see your explanations. <laughs> And they completely uh, 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 ignore that, like if there's an Aisha, like uh, um, Padma Sakhi Mataji, she sent in the Govinda group, she sent a drama, and that uh, when there's someone begging, they'll completely ignore them and they'll say, go, go, um, you're dismissed, we, we don't need you here. And then, uh, they disobey the instructions of the spiritual master. They don't care about the scriptures. Um, um, they think they are the, they are the supreme employer. Uh, and but then they say, uh, uh, but if they are guided by the uh, proper bona fide spiritual master, because then they also there's different types of um, spiritual master. Sometimes a father is called the spiritual master sometimes the proper guru because in the Bhagavad Gita they said it has to come from a straight supreme link succession from straight from God itself so only if they're from, um, from that um, um, straight and proper and bona fide spiritual master then only they can get elevated and to the higher stage and then it becomes life becomes successful wonderful Smriti very, very nicely you describe. Very nice. I'm reminded of that. Uh, what's, her, what's her name who joins from Australia? Savia Para. <laughs> right? So like that you are explaining very nicely, Smriti. Wonderful. Yeah. So we need to elevate ourselves from the mode of passion and ignorance and follow the spiritual masters in Anyone who knows can raise the hand and they can answer. Um, okay, what is, uh, what are the, um, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked us to only eat the prasadam offered to the deity. Means, he said, just eat prasadam then you'll go back to God. Did you say that true or false? Raise your hand if you know the answer. Divyansh? Wait, what was the question again? I the question it. is, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, if we just eat the remnants of foodstuff offered to the deity and do this only, we will go back to Godhead. Uh, so are you asking if it's true or not? Yeah. True. Uh, how we, we, have, we, I mean, like, you have to also chant, like, the Hare Krishna Maha Mantra and do devotional service of the Lord. Very good. Yes, Divya. So it is false. He didn't say that just eat prasadam and eat prasadam only and you don't need to chant nothing. So he said three things, right? Yeah, so you're right. Okay, okay. the next question is... Um, in the Shastras, there is a defect of uh, propensity of cheating. You need to say true or false. Smriti? False, Mataji. In the slide, in, in, in right in front, it says Shastra is without the defects. So, wonderful. Yes, very nice. Okay. So, uh, let me go to the next thing. And anyone who has not answered so far, you can uh, try to try and answer this. So, if we don't read Bhagavad Gita also, it is fine. We can lead, lead ourselves to a better destination. False. Why a uh, false uh, Tulsi Manjari? Because uh, Krishna said 
Krishna spoke it himself and he said that you need to, um, that's the real words and you need to follow that to go back to Godhead. And there's no other place better than, than Krishna is about. Wonderful, Tulsi. Wonderful. Okay. So uh, there are, depending on the source, the misaris are of four types. True or false? Who can answer this? Depending on the source, the miseries are of four types. No one? Mukul, you know the answer for this. Just you need to say true or false. Depending on the, based on the source of the misery, if you classify, there are four types of miseries. False. Very good. So what's the right answer? There's only three. Three, okay. And the next question is, if we, from passion, and even if we are in passion and ignorance, we can go back to Godhead, true or false? No, false. Vinita, yes, Vinita? Uh, I was going to say false. Okay, next question is for you, Vinita. So, um, those in the mode of goodness, they do not have the proper understanding of the Supreme Lord. False. So, can you tell me what's the right thing? Um, people in the mode of goodness do have a right understanding of God because they're in the mode of goodness. Very nice. Rather, people in the mode of passion and ignorance don't have the right understanding. So, um, the next question goes to uh, Tulasi, Tulasi Manjri. So, uh, it's optional to accept a spiritual master. Um, false. Why? Because you need this, uh, someone to guide you in the process. Very nice. Yeah. Wonderful. And someone to guide you means someone living who is in contemporary like you, in the same living as in, in the planet in your time. And then you talk to them, you accept them as a spiritual master, and they accept you as a disciple, not someone who's a previous um, spiritual master or who lived before. So Srila Prabhupada is our Siksha Guru, means he instructs. But he did not say that I will be your initiating spiritual master for the next so many generations to come. So he has his disciples and then his disciples and then his disciples. Like that way, there is parampara coming. And so uh, we have to take guidance and diksha from a living spiritual master so that we can be guided right properly. Otherwise, even by reading Prabhupada's books, we might come into a conclusion uh, may, on our own, if you don't see examples of Srila Prabhupada's disciples, how they are following it, we might misunderstand that. So it's very important to have a bona fide living spiritual master. Do you have any questions? Okay, it's over time now. Thank you all so much uh, for attending today. And this will be the verse that we will memorize uh, for the next week. So we are finished with chapter 16 and we will revise, maybe we revised it today. Um, we can uh, do a small uh, open book test uh, the next week. Just go through the five shlokas that we have done and then uh, we can go to chapter 17. Yeah, but everybody nice, thanks. Mataji. Mataji, if before test, if you can do for a 10 minutes revision also, if somebody needs. 10 15 minutes and then they can do test because test does not take much time, right, Mataji? Can, Usually I, multiple... can I do the test? Is it Kahoot? No. No, it's not Kahoot. Mainly, maybe we'll do a Google form. It will be very simple and it's also open book. So we will do a revision and then you can do, take the test.
yeah mataji it will be best because some mukund and some kids who did not get to hear they can hear little bit and then they can do it yes, mataji we are putting easy question paper let's all try for it yes and also it's only it will be mostly from the translation only from 1 2 3 4 uh, 21 and 24 okay yeah. thank you everyone for coming so let's all offer obeisances to all the wonderful vaishnavas here who have assembled vancha kalpata rubya cha kripa sindhu bhi eva cha patita pavane bhyo vaishnavi bhyo namo namaha shila prabhu pad ki jai nirod shanti ki jai really not little kids kids are big kids all big kids jai hari bol kasik the call